हेलो एवरी वन गुड मॉर्निंग हाउ आर यू आई होप यू ऑल आर गुड सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट आर चैप्टर सेवन विच इज एम एस पेंट नाउ आई विल टेल यू हाउ टू ओपन एम एस पेंट यू हैव टू क्लिक ऑन द स्टार्ट बटन सो वे इज माई स्टार्ट बटन इट इज ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड ऑफ द मॉनिटर सो दिस इज माई स्टार्ट बटन नाउ आई कैन क्लिक ऑन द सर्च बार ऑप्शन सो आई कैन टाइप पी हेयर एंड माई पेंट विल कम so this is my paint app when i click on it my ms paint will be opened now how to draw shapes so shapes are drawn with the help of shapes tool so where can i find my shapes tool in the home tab i can find my shapes tool so my home tab is selected this is my tool area shapes tool area now i can click on the any of the desired shape and i can draw i will show you how to draw a shape so this is cloud i have selected it and now i will hold my left click and drag it so see cloud is drawn now i want a square so i will click on the square and then i will hold my left click and drag it see my square is drawn i can draw a star also i can have clicked on the star now star is selected i will hold my left click and draw a star see three figures are drawn i can draw any of the shape which is in the shapes tool with the help of my mouse now i can change the outline of the shape or the color of the shape outline so how can i change the color of my shape so see these are the colors so when i choose a color like i want a green star so i have choose this green color which is showing me in color 1 now in this uh, this shape area i can choose a star now i will hold the left click and drag it see my green star is there so in this way i can <coughs> change the outline of the star color of the outline now i can fill it with color also like like if i want a yellow color in the star i will choose yellow color and i will choose fill with color option which is in the tools section <coughs> i have clicked on it now i can fill it with color see now my star is with yellow color now i can change the thickness of the line of the star how i can change it suppose i want a square and i want a purple square so i have clicked on it now these are the sizes of the line see the thickness of the line we have selected this line now i want a thin line so i have selected it here now if i draw a square see the line thickness of the line it is very thin right if i want a thick line i will choose the last option and i will draw a square or a rectangle like i want a green color now i am drawing it see it is the most thickest line now there is one line also this is the this is the middle one and if i want a pentagon i can draw a pentagon see the thickness so in each and every figure there is a different thickness of line now i will tell you how to fill different shapes with different fill style so first i have to select a shape suppose i have chosen a star now i will choose fill with different styles now there is no fill solid color crayon marker oil natural pencil water color so i want natural pencil now i will draw a star which is green in color now i want to fill it with different color so i will choose a yellow color so the outline changes but i will choose it again green i will draw my star again now it is drawn now i want a yellow color now my style is selected which is natural pencil now i will click on bucket this is fill with color now when i fill it color see this is a different style of coloring so it is coming like when i when we colored with the help of a pencil it is coming this like this way so i have clicked outside also so it becomes yellow in the whole drawing canvas now 
in this way i have colored my style star now if i want a rectangle with purple color my style i will change my style to oil so i will draw a rectangle now i want to fill it with pink color so again i will draw a rectangle now i want to fill it with pink color i will choose fill with color now see so it is not a solid color it is oil color so now i want to save my drawing i am thinking that i am done with my drawing how i will save my students now i will tell you how to save the file so first i will click on the file tab and then some options will come like new open save save as so first i have to click on save now this dialog box will appear now i will save my file in documents or desktop or new volume d i can save it anywhere so i will save my file in new volume d so i have clicked selected it it will become blue now i will give my file name rectangle because i have made a rectangle here now i have giving it a name rectangle now my file is i have given my file now i will click on save now it is saved see here the name of the file is changed to rectangle now my work is done i want to i want a new file so i will click on new see a new file will come i can do drawing here now i i am thinking that my file which i have saved earlier has some work which i can do so i will oh, how will I, i will open that file i will click on file then i will click on open and then i will click on rectangle and it will get open see it's asking for this file to save i don't want to save it don't say see my file is open so in this way we can save our file i hope you have understood the topic now practice more with the help of your parents thank you